Here's a brief little addendum to my uh, recent fan video. Forgive the mess, this is my computer workbench and it's in the process of being reorganized. Uh, this was, uh, this is a little box fan, I'd guess maybe 12, 14 inches, I don't know the size. Uh, Patton is the brand. It's a uh, three speed. Got the switch up top there. Uh, like I said, I don't know how old it is, but she's had it as long as I can remember. Uh, she recently passed away and we were cleaning out her house and we found it again today. For a box fan, this thing is really well built. Look at how thick this thing is. And I'll, here's the back. Just tells Patton Electric Company, New Haven, Connecticut, do not use in a window. And this thing has a really, really large motor. I'm trying to get it to focus in on there. But you can kind of see it in there. It's not one of those flat pancake style motors like what you usually find in box fans. It's just a it's a standard motor. But there's one really interesting thing about this fan, which is why I wanted to show it to you, and it's why I remember it for so long. First, let's turn it on. It's on high. And it moves a lot of air. See, I'm going to turn it away so it's not blowing right at the camera, so you'll be able to hear me better. But, see, just a nice little box fan, but here's what I find really interesting about it. This is something I have never seen on any other fan before. This little blue knob, look what happens when you twist it. The grill spins. Supposedly it's a safety feature for houses that have little kids. You can Make it go faster and slower by tightening and loosening. Let's see if we can get it to slow down a little bit. There we go. I've always found that kind of interesting. Like I said, it's a three speed. So there, just slowed it down to medium. Let's loosen this up now. That's just the airflow making this spin. There isn't a little electric motor in there. Because I can stop it with my fingers and it won't hurt anything. So yeah, that's one reason I've always found this particular fan interesting. Like I said before, I don't actively collect them. So I don't really know anything about them. But this one, I will admit, I have been interested in for a long time. Just because of this odd feature. That's it.